Hi, and welcome to Three Questions With. Today, my guest is my friend Mo Daniels. Mo is a realtor. Hey, Mo, welcome to the show. Thank you very much, Kevin. So tell us a little bit about your business, Mo. Well, I am a realtor with Remax Innovative Properties in Nashville, New Hampshire. I'm currently licensed in New Hampshire. Um, the way I differentiate myself as far as the business goes is I run my business by referral. Most agents will spend a lot of their time and money and resources on prospecting for new business. And that might include cold calling, door knocking, direct mail, et cetera. And I don't do any of that. Rather, I spend my time and energy giving the best that I can to my clients before, during, and after the transaction so that they will feel comfortable and confident in referring people to me. And as part of that, I have, uh, because I think it's important to build relationships and to stay connected with people, I have a client appreciation program where I send my clients an item of value every month, which allows them to keep up with what's happening in the real estate world as, far, as well as other um, important advice on other matters involving our general lives. And that allows me to maintain some level of contact. So if and when the time comes that they have a question or a concern, they know they can reach out to me and I'll do my best to help them. Beautiful. So tell us about the advantages of hiring a realtor when you want to buy or sell a home. And also, Mo, how do you pick a realtor? Because there are quite a few of you. Actually, that's a good point, Kevin. In the state of New Hampshire, there are over 6,000 licensed agents in the state of New Hampshire. And I think it is important. When you look at the context of buying a home for most people, it might be, if not the single largest purchase they'll ever make in their life. And if you think about, say, a retirement account or even an expensive car, you're going to seek the guidance of professionals and advisors to guide you on that process. And I don't, I think buying a home or selling a home is the, is the same thing. You want to, you want to have someone that knows the business, understands what your expectations are, understands what concerns or fears you have going into the process, because it can be a very highly emotional process. It can be very complex. The value in having a realtor is they can break down those processes. They can provide some level of education as well as guidance before, during, and after the transaction. I think in trying to find an agent, I mean, you know, you've got platforms like Zillow and Trulia where agents pay a significant amount of money to advertise in those platforms. And that's not an indictment of people who do that. But I think because everybody's different, everybody's expectations about what the process should be and how they want to see it play out will factor into interviewing agents. And oftentimes people within a sphere of influence will ask the question, hey, I'm thinking of buying or selling, you know, is there an agent you would recommend? And that's one of the reasons why I spend as much time and energy and attention as I do with my own clients so that when that conversation comes up, someone can say, oh yeah, give Mo Daniels a call. She took really good care of me and she'll take good care of you. But I think it is important if when you meet with the realtor for the first time, if you're not getting a sense of confidence and you're not feeling comfortable with that person, by all means, give them, give them a chance and, and ask some questions to get a deeper understanding if there's good chemistry there. And if not, you know what, keep looking. But again, most oftentimes, people in your sphere of influence will be able to recommend somebody. And if not, you know, you, you can do some online um, searching as well. So Mo, how can people reach out to you? How can they learn more? Well, I'm, I'm part of a team actually at uh, Remax with my sister and my niece. We're called the Holland Team. And we have a website and the address is uh, www.findingyourhome.net. In order to reach me directly and probably more expeditiously, people could call my cell at 603-233-6033. They can either text me or call me and I will get back to them as soon as they can.
make a connection. Well, I appreciate you taking the time to jump on the show with us today. Thank you so much, Kevin. Appreciate it, my friend. You just watched Three Questions with Mo Daniels, brought to you by the New England B2B Networking Group. To learn more about the New England B2B Networking Group, go out and visit our website at newenglandb2bnetworking.com.